Absolutely. Dr. Yoon, I understand you have a unique surgical procedure. Would you mind describing this technique for me? Well, the, the uh, conventional surgical method for uh, total hip osteoplasty is cutting the skin about 15 to 20 centimeters. And they go into deep into the muscle and they cut part of a gluteus medius muscle or short external rotator muscles. And when we cut the muscle, we have to repair the muscle again and it takes time for the recovery because we have to shoot the muscle and the shoot muscle should be really repaired. But in my surgical technique, I'm not cutting any muscle. Instead, I have to uh, cut the skin about uh, seven centimeters anteriorly and another incision about five centimeters posteriorly. Uh, by doing that, we are cutting the femoral neck and insert the acetabular component in the anterior opening. Uh, and the second opening, uh, through this opening, we insert the stem into the femur. And uh, we do not cut any muscle. Instead, uh, we use intermuscular interval so that we can, uh, after uh, putting in the uh, artificial joint, the patient can recover right away because we do not cut any muscle. Therefore, the patient recovery is really fast and the final function is much better than conventional surgery. Are there any side effects? Well, uh, every uh, uh, surgical technique, like a total hibasoplasty, we have complications that is possible, but the, the uh, rate of complications is really low. And uh, by doing uh, two incision surgery, because we recover very uh, fastly, therefore I believe some complications is much lower than conventional surgery. But if you do not have a, a really good surgical technique, you may have some more uh, complications. But uh, in my case, because I have done more than 2,000 uh, surgeries, uh, I can avoid every complication. So uh, uh, in my recent uh